Okay, witam was wszystkich bardzo serdecznie z tej strony Maras. Man I barely seen on TV was my last hope. I didn't know what connection there could be between the Mayans and what had happened to me. But at that point, I was ready to accept any explanation that could make sense out of the nightmare that my life had become. Hello, uh, I'm a journalist and I have an appointment with Professor Kiryakin. The professor's waiting for you. No, łatwo poszło. A właśnie, a to jest gra, właśnie zagrajmy projekt z cyklu, zagrajmy w Fireheart. Troszeczkę się zamotałem, ale mam nadzieję, że mi to wyba wybaczycie. Ok, idziemy do profesorka. Zobaczmy, co nam powie na ten temat. Profesor Kiryakin? Yes. My name's John Cunningham. We spoke on the phone. I'm a journalist and I'm gathering information for an article I'm writing about the Mayan religion. Ah, yes, I've been waiting for you, young man. What um, what paper did you say you write for once again? Mm hmm. Uh, National Geographic. I write for National Geographic. Uh oh. It's uh, it's curious, but your face seems familiar to me. Have we met somewhere before? Do you? Yeah, I get that a lot. Uh, I guess I must have one of those boring faces everybody sees everywhere. Well then, let's uh, have a go at it. <laughs> Where would you like to start? Hmm. Can you tell me anything about Kweknitlan? Of course. Come, I'll introduce you. Oh, super. Sprawnie idzie. <coughs> Nie jest najgorzej. You see before you the ancient Mayan god Kweknitlan, the serpent with the two heads. One head sees in this reality, the second in the other world. By opening both mouths, the Mayan oracles could see through the serpent into the other world. Uh -huh. In the could you explain this other world? Or the world beyond our own, the kingdom of the gods and the dead. The Mayans believe that human sacrifices allowed them to hear the voices of the deceased and see into the future. Mm -hmm. Ofiary? Tell me, how did the sacrificial ceremony work? Come, I'll show you. Uh oh. Muszę stanąć gdzieś przed tobą, nie? Ale jakoś nie musiałem przesuwać. This painting, dating from the first century BC, shows a sacrificial ceremony. The victim's agony must have lasted quite some time. The priority being to keep the mouths open as long as possible. The victim was stabbed three times. Each wound cutting a pulmonary artery leading to the heart. Ritual, prorok zabójstwa. The oracle is not the one stabbing the victim? Oh, the oracle must never soil himself with the blood of another. That is why he chooses a sort of proxy, another <coughs> person in the crowd, totally at random. This person becomes the executor. The oracle takes complete control of the executor, manipulating him from a distance. Mm -hmm. Cut. What happened to the executor after the sacrifice? He went mad and committed suicide after accomplishing his part of the ritual. A Mayan sacrifice. That's what it was. You aren't a journalist, are you? Who are you? Mm-hmm. Powiedz prawdę. Zobaczymy, co zrobi. My name is Lucas Kane. The police are looking for me about a murder that I did not commit. But I was the executor. You're a murderer? I'm innocent. I stabbed someone I'd never seen before, three times, cutting his arteries, just like you described. Do you mean to say that there is a Mayan oracle still living today? Mm -hmm. but, but that's completely impossible. 
Pokażę Have you ever seen this symbol before? Oh, it's the symbol of Quetnitlan. The executors cut this into their own forearms before accomplishing this sacrifice. No, prawda, so, prawda. It is true. My God, the Codex was right. The Codex? What are you talking about, Professor? You can't stay here. Your picture is in the paper that the security guard is reading. He's sure to recognize you. Come, let's leave here. And I'll tell you all about it. No, super. No, to idzie... Za nim. <śmiech> Niech dam jakieś sprawozdanie z tego. To jest bardzo interesujące. Thank you for your help, Professor. Aha. No, jasne, jasne. Ach, te hollywoodzkie sceny. Come on, maszujemy przyciski, maszujemy. O, oh, super. Nice. No, pięknie. Super. No. Oh, epic. No, okay, udało nam się przeżyć. A co jest profesor? Profesor. The Codex speaks of the coming of a child, a prophet. The answer to all of life's questions. <coughs> the oracle kills to find the child. <coughs> uh oh. Mamy problem. Super. Okej, okay. dobra, dziecka, pocieniem mnie taki dłuższy dziś odcinek, bo widzę, że są takie w miarę powiązane z Lukasem cały czas miejsca. To trzeba by tego nie pociągnąć. Przynajmniej wam się zrewanżuje za te krótkie wstawki. Okej, okay, zobaczmy o co chodzi. Few men are capable of resisting an oracle. What is there so different about you? The chroma. You have the chroma. So that explains it. How did you ever acquire such a power? No matter. What matters is the time has come for you to die. Okay. Chroma? The chroma? What does that mean? The force that created the universe. The origin of everything. It gives extraordinary powers to those who possess it. Mm -hmm. Vizia? This is some kind of dream, isn't it? You're not really there in front of me, are you? <laughs> Reality is a notion that doesn't have any meaning where I come from. We are not really here, and yet you will die here. Believe me, this world is just as real as your own. Mm -mm, Enough talk. Other matters await my attention. We will see each other again in the other world. Okej. Okay. Szkoda, że się nie mogę skupić na obrazie. 
A niech ich będzie. Okej, okay, widzę, że przyspiesza to. Super, na razie uciekamy. Ok, udało się. Jeszcze jednego nie wdusiłem. Mhm. Super. Nie spodziewałem nawet. Agatha, but how? Listen closely, Lucas. Those who employ the Oracle are searching for a little girl, a perfectly pure soul that's never been incarnated. Her coming was foretold by the most ancient prophecy in human history. She's the one you see in your dreams. You must find her before the Oracle does and put her someplace safe. Hurry. There isn't much time, and they are already back on your trail. Okay. No logic. Ah, dobra, logic. Wiecie co? To już będzie kolejny odcinek. Chciałem troszeczkę sobie odpocząć. Na chwilę obecną zrobić trochę miejsca na dysku przed następnym nagrywaniem. Także kolejne odcinki już. Wkrótce. A na razie co? Ja byłem Maras, to bardzo z gry Feinhardt, nieco dłuższe jak zawsze, tak więc komentujcie, oceniajcie. I jeśli chcecie zobaczyć już po momentku zakończenia serii, bo już to jest większa połowa i pomału zbliżamy się do końca, to zasubskrybujcie mój kanał, przynajmniej będziecie na bieżąco. Trzymajcie się, do usłyszenia, cześć!